Hello, um, today I'm going to share with you my own version of Filipino style beef steak. In this recipe, I use 2 pounds of rump roast, but sometimes I use chuck roast also. Make sure that your meat has a little bit of fat in it. And then um, I slice the meat thinly. Um, it's for quicker cooking time. That's why I slice it thinly. I think all of you knows that too. And then I marinate the meat with two tablespoons of soy sauce and at least one fourth teaspoon of black pepper. And then just mix them together. Um, normally, I would let it um, sit for an hour or two just to allow the meat to absorb the seasoning. And now we are ready to cook. So I put one tablespoon of oil in the pan and then I saute the garlic and the onions until they become soft and translucent And after sauteing the garlic and the onion, I add in the meat. And then I just stir them together until they are mixed well for about one to two minutes. And then I cover it for five minutes. After five minutes, as you can see, the juice of the meat has come out and the meat is brown. So I think it's time to add in the seasoning. I would start by adding one fourth cup of oyster sauce. and um, some black pepper and then just stir them together as you go along you can add some more seasoning until your taste desire is achieved you can also add other seasoning for those who want stronger flavor after mixing them together, I would let it cook for another 10 to 15 minutes, stirring it once in a while. And then when you see that the liquid or the sauce of the meat has reduced, you can add in three cups of water. And then let it cook for another 10 to 15 minutes. So after 15 minutes, if the meat is not cooked or soft yet, you can add another cup of water and just let it simmer until meat is fully cooked. And now the meat is fully cooked. So I add in more onions and stir for one minute. 
beef steak is ready so if you have questions um, just write it down at the comment section below thank you for watching